Hey there, nerds, and welcome to Four Nerds Gaming. You are on with the wife, and we are here continuing the saga of Bertha McBig Boobs. That's right. We're going to see what she's up to. Where did we leave Bertha last? What is she doing next? What has fate done to our heroine in this wasteland? That is the Mojave Desert. Sunset sarsaparilla. You ever had sarsaparilla? Do you know it's sarsaparilla, not sarsaparilla? Yeah, I grew up calling it sarsaparilla. Nobody ever corrected me. Thanks, Mom. It's okay, she doesn't watch this. All right, so we are in the Mojave Wasteland, and we are supposed to go inquire about our delivery assignment with the administrator... And find the men who killed me. Well, tried to kill me, right? So, in case you forgot, whoops, I hit the wrong button. In case you forgot what Miss Bertha looks like. Let's see if I can remember what button to push. There it is. Bertha. There she is. Say hi. Hi, Bertha. Pretty pink hair, of course. She looks nothing like me. What is that? Wait, is she stinky or something? What is that? Oh, good lord. All right. Okay. So, that's it. Let's go and see what trouble we can get into, hmm? shall we? I guess we shall. Okay, I've got a gun, and I'm not afraid to use it. Um, yeah, you hear that click? Yeah, that's not supposed to happen. I wonder if I have any, uh, charge in that gun there. Let's see, weapons, laser pistol, uh, it says I do. I don't know, but you know what, though? I think I want the shotgun. Do I have ammo? I've got some ammo, so. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Oops. That wasn't what I intended to do. I intended to do that. You know, it's been a while since I played this game, so I'm going to have to kind of learn the, uh... Controls all over again. <laughs> That's not it. Mm. That's it. Okay, yeah. Alright, so, on the PS3, when you want to put your gun away in Fallout New Vegas, you hold the square button. Sometimes I can be a little bit of an idiot. Just sometimes, though. Not always. So, yeah, there's a lot of walking in this game because um, there's no vehicles. You know, and... You know, so that's kind of a contrast when it comes to... Uh, yeah, again, um, some of the other games that Bethesda's put out, like Oblivion and um, Skyrim, and you know those games, you have um, horses. And then with Skyrim, they introduced the wonderful concept of the carriage, so that you could actually use a carriage to get where you wanted to go, which is pretty darn awesome, if you ask me. Now I see. I think I see people up there, so I'm not going to go there. Of course, that could be a tree. I'm pretty far away, so and that's, you know, kind of, you know, tall, so. Ooh, stuff! I've discovered several locations and can now use fast travel. Fast travel's awesome, by the way. Oh, it's empty. Where's this place? What's this place? Jean Skydiving. I wonder if anybody's here. Doesn't look like it looks pretty dead, doesn't it? Well, not even any critters to kill. Okay, but... Oh, that was... A noise. Oh, I knocked over a barrel. <laughs> I skittish a little bit. Oh, I have to have a lockpick skill of 50. I don't think I even have any lockpicks. Much less lockpick skills. So, alright, well. On them. Um, there's a... What? Okay. There's a key. I wonder if this key, aha, uh -huh, it does, looky there, I got lots of stuff. I'm just going to take it all, because honestly, I don't know what I need and what I don't need, so, you know, we're just going to take all of it and just uh, play with all of it and pray for the best. All right, so let's go back in here to the Mojave Wasteland. 
So this game um, obviously is set in Las Vegas, Nevada, uh, which I've never actually been to. I've been to Nevada. I've been through Nevada, not to Nevada. I've been through Nevada, but I have not been to Las Vegas. So, you know, that's on my bucket list. It's a place that I hope to someday go to and visit. Sexy sleepwear. Oh, yes, because everybody needs some of that, right? Yeah, especially in the desert. Because it gets hot in the desert, really. I mean, come on. Who wants to wear, like, a jacket and jeans all the time? You know, maybe in the, you know, at night because it gets cold. But, you know, during the day it's like, you know, 500 degrees and stuff, you know? So, yeah. So, I think that sexy sleepwear is going to come in handy. So, but yeah. I've always wanted to go and never have. And so, I'm hoping that maybe someday... I will get to go and see Vegas, see the bright lights, maybe do some can gambling. Powder Ganger Camp West. As opposed to Ow. Ow. That hurt. What are you looking at me for? What? You eyeballing me? Yeah, I am. Okay, I'm gonna talk to your friend then. No one's gonna ignore me. Just keep, keep on walking. Fine then. What if I don't want to? What is that? That's a note. I'm going to read it. Okay. I read it. Haha. <laughs> Didn't tell me not to, so, you know. Oh gosh. Ow. I just blew my legs off. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't want that. Okay. Um, I, I don't want no trouble. Yes, I know exactly what I need to do. Don't you just love the, you know, tutorials? Okay, so I need aid. I have dirty water, but what I need, actually what I probably need to go to is stats. I do have stim packs, which is pretty awesome. So we're going to go limbs. I'm going to fix my leg. I'm going to fix my other leg. And I'm going to use one, two more. Yeah, there we go. All right. And I'm going to stay away from those powder gangers because, you know, they're kind of mean poo-poo heads anyway. Mm, we don't like mean poo-poo heads, do we? No, we don't. Because they're bad. They're bad. So, yeah, it's a long walk to where I'm going here. And there's a lot of nothingness. It's very barren. And so this could be one of those really long, boring episodes Especially because sometimes I don't know what to talk about. So, yeah. Well, you know, I thought I'd, I'd hear, hear something we'll talk about. We'll talk about bucket lists. I have on my bucket list, as I said before, I would love to see Las Vegas sometime. And there's a few other things on my bucket list. Like, um, I would like to record a CD sometime. Like an actual CD. Whoops. Oh, that was so stupid of me. Oh, wow, that was gross. <laughs> that was an awesome shot, though. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, so I'd like to record. The other one's running away. He's like, I don't want none of this. <sighs> anyway, I'd like to record an album sometime. Um, it'd be cool to do a duet with a really, you know, big artist. Like, um, well... <laughs> It'd be cool to, you know, to, to collaborate on a song with like, um, you know, the new kids on the block. Cause I, I kind of like them kind of a lot, you know, it's kind of a thing from my childhood. I'm, I'm going that way to prim, prim's off limits. Why? What's going on in prim? Do you hate it when people interrupt your conversations? Oh, you interrupted me. Do you care? He doesn't care. We were talking. I was having a conversation with these people. Okay. Um, yeah. Shouldn't you be protecting the town? While he's talking, I'm going to open my Coke. Yeah. Well, I can take care of myself. All right. I won't say that I wasn't warned. Okay. Now, back to what I was saying. So, remnants of my childhood, um, New Kids on the Block. They were and are still awesome. Yes, they are still recording. And if you hadn't heard any of the new stuff, then shame on you. You need to hear it because their new songs are awesome. 